so um let's see what we can do we have the golden razor we have the raw liver which is great because otherwise we would have started with one heart we also have the missing page two as a trinket we have we have really good dps like above average damage and basic tier eight it's like slightly above average tier eight but who cares and we have a whole stat <laughs> That's also a great item. What is my opinion on the old paths to mother and to the beast? I like them. Um, the, the escape sequence from mother is a bit annoying. Like, the escape sequence from mother is like the only thing in the game that gets worse the more often you do it, except maybe delirium too. So that's a bit of a... Oh wait, it's an XL course. Oh, I didn't even notice. I never noticed this on the first, uh, these on the first two floors. <laughs> Oh my god. Metal plate and host hat. Our immunities are off the charts. Don't enter the devil deal. That is the plan on a Mega Satan run. Either that or get so many hearts on this floor that I can actually... Um, just get everything from the sack room. In actually, hold up. Hold up, that is really good for the sacro. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is self-inflict the damage too, so I can do this. Hold up, hold up. Hold up, hold up. Chat, you ready? One. Two. Three. Wow. No hits so far. Great. Oops. Might get the intro. We still have a chance to get the intro room instead of the devil deal. If we can get to, I think, five plays. Five or six. Six. Dude, I'm, dude, I'm missing everything. What is that? <laughs> Excuse you! Come on, I want some more hard drops. I know it's uh, normal mo uh, hard mode and I'm probably not gonna get those, but give me the full hearts. Hold up, that has a chance of giving me full hearts. Oh, hold up, hold up. Let the exciting min-maxing begin. I guess we go for these coins because our shop is gonna be open. Okay, half heart. That's a start. No secret room here, but it was worth looking for it. Roll better, silly. Yeah, I, I don't know. That was not my finest moment in terms of RNG. Oh, hold up. I can't touch that as long as my devil chance is at 100%. Because that is not smart. You know, it's really unlikely on a uh, angel run to make guppy, but at the same time, I always say an early hive mind is great because it's almost never useless. I mean, all we need to get is like a rotten baby or something like that. There's a ton of items that generate flies and/or spiders, so I'm I'm going for it. I can still get um. A health up here and get healed for two hearts and suddenly we are back in this in terms of feeding the sack room too thank you for bombing thank you for your service i appreciate it i know he got resistance to his own bombs but it's still a lot of damage it's still like 50 and my tears currently deal four so Excuse me. Be blessed, thank you. I need it for a game like this. The blessing shall help. Okay, there's another full red heart. And there's more at all order. I shouldn't have picked up the red heart. Alright, meat for some damage is nice too. 
Then we take this with us. One of the rare instances of Crowhard being actually good. I appreciate it. 67% chance for increased angel room chance. Of course. <laughs> All right, I got my angel room anyway. And I just realized that I don't have a bomb. Okay, it's okay. We'll we'll fix this. All right, Jesus juice. That's okay. We can uh, we can feed some of our soul hearts now. We first of all we can do the boss. First of all, we can do the boss and uh, maybe get another health up from that for a nice heal. And even if we don't, we can feed some soul hearts to just get the key pieces right here. That's fine. That is that is a okay. Let's do this first and see what we get. Because this is going to be easy peasy now with the Jesus juice and the meat. Never have I ever wanted to see a heart more. Than you know what would be perfect? Marrow. Because Mero drops you like three red hearts, right? <laughs> and then the bone heart on top. Mero would be dope. Could also just give me, um, what's it called? Matchbook, because I'm going to get the injury room here again. Or that is going to give me a bomb too. Sure. I was like half expecting it to give me a troll bomb. <laughs> there, see? All planned, all planned. Oh, of course it's the red angel. Oh, brother. Oh, we're gonna be here for a while. Oh, what am I doing? Can you please hug the fire a bit more? Come on, dude. I'm gonna need your help here to defeat you. Thank you. You know, maybe I can't actually feed more soul hearts to the to the game. Okay, after, after I got adjusted to the fight, it actually worked out quite nicely. Of course, he spawns one last angel as an FU to me. Well, that's okay. <laughs> alright, alright. Uh, huh. How does that work with the... With the last half... Rotten heart. I guess we're gonna do science. Is this gonna take only the rotten heart now, or is it also gonna take half of a soul heart? Science. Ah. Oh, it only took the half soul heart. Nice, nice. Okay, so I, I would have to put in one blue heart and fight the angel. I think I can do that. You know what? Let's open that golden chest. See what we get there. That golden chest probably has the highest odds right now of giving me some more HP. Alright, alright, oh! Alright, alright! The shop only had garbage at this point, right? If I remember correctly. I literally don't remember. Uh, we can open this now too. Maybe I can get some soul hearts out of this. Or, I don't know, Guppy's head would be pretty dope, honestly, with, uh, with the infestation already. Alright, those are gonna help against the angel. I don't want King Baby. Free secret room with the other barrel? No, I know what the... Actually, maybe super secret room. Ah... <sighs> Good thing there's no time limit on this run. Otherwise, I wouldn't be here still after nine minutes. <laughs> I, I don't think the super secret room is here, but actually... No, actually, I'm starting to think it is here. Hold on. Oh, yeah. 
All right. Okay, we're gonna take the crow heart one more time. We're gonna fight the blue angel, and then I'm probably gonna put in one soul heart as well, because I have a chance to to win big. I have a chance to win big here, chat. But let's do the blue angel first. I kept the bombs on the ground here on purpose, so I can yeah do that. <laughs> And find the secret room. Nice. How sick would it be if that gave me a heart? Close. Okay, and... Uh, do I play it? Do I not play it? Th this is just me being paranoid, but I don't actually want to hug that thing with the... Uh, with the crow heart. I know that's not how it works. After your red hearts are depleted, it starts taking your soul hearts, but I'm still kind of paranoid about it. I actually would have preferred the soul hearts, obviously, because I, I already had a very uh, sizable stash of money. But then again, I mean, floor one key on a Mega Satan run. There's not a whole lot to complain about here. And I'm a German, so trust me, I've tried to complain about it. We're going to keep the petrified poop because that actually has a respectable chance of um, getting us back to full HP on the next floor. How did I manage to lose all but one roll? It is that fabled streamer luck that you've heard so much of. If I get a dicey room here, I'm just going to use the stars card to instantly uh, teleport to the uh, item room. Room is pretty dicey, honestly. I'm very tempted. All right, uh, let's keep going. All right, give me that key. Rob's won a lot of rolls in Poker Kaizo. This is the payback. I mean, that's true. We had some really, really lucky fights yesterday. Okay, I can't exactly open that. It's a sign. Yeah, I'm just gonna go for it. Zip. Cracked orb. Not a huge fan of that item, to be honest. I really think it's a bit overhyped. Sure, it gives you additional info, which is great. I love additional info, but... A lot of the time, that info just isn't useful. Sometimes it shows you the super secret room or the secret room, and that's pretty hot, but... I wanted to see those, so I'd prefer to get the blue map. <laughs> oh, boy. That champion over there is terrifying. <laughs> Actually, really, really scary. But let me take care of everything else first. Would it work with Dull Razor? It should. Ah. petrified poop do some work for me here actually no i have a better idea how to get to full hp not through the power of poops but through the power of getting a magic mushroom right here and now close okay well at least i got the secret room out of that thank you sacred orb i appreciate you right after talking smack about it too there's my uh magic wash oh that's the same pill twice you know my policy on double pills uh, when I see double pills, I blow up a stack of four mushrooms and get a magic mush. Nope. Paralysis. Fantastic pill. What's this? Hmm. Yeah, maybe, maybe not. Paralysis. Yep. 
Wait, is that you setting me off doll razor or have I just been have I just been no that's not dolly uh, that's not that's not doll razor, that's uh, uh, golden razor. That consumes money and gives you damage for the room. It's actually pretty good with 72 coins, but right now I'm mostly hoping for a store with a reroll machine. Which is why I'm not using the razor yet. Although it's probably gonna find some uses in the boss room. Oh hi. I don't need it here, this is just gonna be annoying. At least until this guy blew up a bunch of rocks. Mr. Boom is oh, probably better than the razor, is it? Maybe not with 72 coins. I don't know. First thing I want to do, though, is take Mr. Boom and go to the super secret room. Bit of an unfortunate landing point. Uh, might as well get that. The sign. Hey! Hold up. Do I have another one of those in here? No. And that down there is a paralysis pill. I don't care about that. I wish I had a bomb for this room. No excuse to get hit here, though. Hey, money. More cardio. Okay, maybe I am taking that golden razor with me. Cracked Orb can reveal the Ultra Secret Room, but in 99% of cases, that doesn't really do anything for you. How sick would it be if we could actually have a reroll machine in that store? Okay, use that, then pick up the charge key. Oh, what the heck, man. No reroll machine, a battery pack. Really? I'm gonna buy this because potential bombs. I'm gonna buy that and that. I have so much money. Might as well. Emperor card. Mm. Hey, what does this lead to? We've already seen a. It's just a random dead end? Okay. I respect it. You can always donate money where I can. Wrong mushroom, but I appreciate the effort. All right, let's uh, actually use this razor to get some more damage and golden tears and take out this guy. Uh-oh. So if you're ever looking for a good example of how not to fight Fistula, I uh, can point to this run. But you know what? When you have eight damage tears, it's okay. Okay, there's a uh, Devil Dion. We actually have some hearts to pay. Two of spades, I'm just gonna pop immediately. Is that double judgment? Oh, it's double emperor. Okay. You know what? I'm still a huge fan of Death's List. And this is actually the kind of run that can make really good use of it. So let's do it. Uh, I've got a bunch of Emperor cards here, and what's the other one? High Priestess. Maybe I just take that with me. Yeah. All right. Death's list. Let's make it work, chat. Fantastic.
Easy peasy. It's gonna spawn me like a golden bomb over there, right? Oh, close enough. Oh, I hate this room. <laughs> Mainly because it's annoying. It's not exactly hard to beat, but... What the heck, man? You're supposed to give me enemies. Oh my god. You're supposed to give me enemies so I can try and execute Death's List. Come on, game. Don't be like that now. Oh, well, I'm not getting Death's List here, am I? <laughs> nah. No. I am getting a store here, though, which is pretty great. Broken modem! I, I can really only emphasize it every time we find it, but Twitch chat has truly converted me on broken modem. <laughs> it's, it's really, really good. <laughs> I didn't think it was, but it is. Temperance machine. Bro, am I going to get enemies? There we go. Look at that! Death's list executed. And we got a bomb for it again. Hermit card. Mm. Dude. <laughs> well, I've, I have my doubts about getting this one. Okay, give me a single enemy boss room like Bombino. Something without ads. He spawned a fly that then blocked my shot and died to ruin death's list. That's tragic. That is tragic. I mean, it's okay, but that sucks. And that was that was really rude. I took so much care there to actually get death's list off, and then that happens. Oh, okay. I'm I'm going for it. I'm going for it. I'm death listing envy, watch. Oh god, maybe I'm not death listing envy. Why did I think this was a good idea? I'm committed now. Oh my god. Also, this is definitely one of the rooms that Broken Modem made significantly harder. Like, this is definitely one of the fights that I thought of when I was a Broken Modem hater. He's isolated. Get him. Ah! There we go. All right. Did it. And all of that for eh, a coin. Ooh, and a crystal key. All right. Although that's not from Death's List, but still, that's a very good one. That's a good one. I'm not going for death list here. <laughs> I'm going to need like 5 million hits here. If it wasn't my last soul heart, I might actually go for it, but not like this. I'm going to get way more than enough opportunities to, to death list it up here. Okay, library. Come on. Go for revs? Sure. Sure. That's a good one. Although Book of Revelations, funnily enough, does make it harder to execute Death's List because my meat cube is going to accidentally kill stuff sometimes. But, you know. Wait, how did he die? Did I hit him too many times accidentally? Okay. Dude, what is it with the golden... What is it with the cardio pennies today? Crazy. 
Do I already know where the Ultra Seeker is now, right? Yeah, that, that, that was another one that wasn't really going to go my way. What? Okay. Well, I wasn't going to get that one either. Man, I was so hyped about Death's List, and I think I have not done it justice so far. But I'll try to get better, chat. Five cents is okay. Devil's Crown? I don't think so. I'm gonna go in here. I have Book of Revelations. Copy's tail! Copy waiting room is engaged, ladies and gents. Oh, what a stupid location for the Ultra Secret. What a stupid location for the secret room. Holy. Look at that. <laughs> that is so bad. No tinted rock. Use another one of them sack rooms. All right. Now, and now we death's list. After I turn up the game sound on my end a bit. Oh, I could have used the temperance card, sure. Dang, I forgot about that. Curse of the Lost. Oh boy. With multi-segment enemies, it's really tough to actually execute Death's List. I'm gonna try, but... I mean, it's so easy to hit the wrong... Yep, yeah, to hit the wrong segment. And it actually counts every single segment for the hitbox. And even then, like, you can just get screwed over with the last two segments if the skull doesn't jump where you want it to. So this is probably just an unexecutable enemy. All right, nice. Nice coin. Oh. Yeah, no. Probably not happening in this room. Okay, because I don't see the map, I have no idea where a good spot is. Or the thing, and where isn't. <laughs> you know, game, you could have gone on the red fly and made my job a lot easier here. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Maybe. Maybe I'm regretting it. And even then the bomb flies. How do I do this? Okay. All right. All right. One down, two to go. Uh, three to go. Sorry. Is it? Is the guy that the the thing is on much faster than the other two? Bro, I never noticed that Death's List actually speeds up enemies. Like, the fly literally got faster when the, the skull got on top of it. And we got plus one damage from Death's List. Amazing. That's great. That is value, ladies and gentlemen. Ow. Broken Modem actually kind of helps with Death's List, too. That's pretty neat. Oh? Alright, Nicola is okay. 
Oh yeah, right. That's where I came from. Ugh. I'm not doing this. Nope. That ain't happening. Oh, maybe it is. Hold up. I didn't realize splitting them from their, their bodies wouldn't count as killing an enemy. So it's really only four enemies I have to take out here. I thought it would be eight. They take damage in the process, but if we get tier 8 from it or something similar, it's definitely worth it. We got range. <laughs> not really what I was thinking about, but not the worst either. I mean, range is useful. Ra oh, nice. Range is especially useful when you don't have any. That's when you notice how good range is. Just, just getting some of it for free is it's fine. Why? Do not spawn enemies, sir. I repeat, do not spawn enemies. Thank you. Easiest deaths list of my life. Oh, what the heck? Yeah, I'm not doing this. <laughs> what? I didn't get all of them? I'm already 99 cents, dude. Okay, greed on the secret room means he's not in the store, though. So that's pretty good. Oh, oops. Rip death's list. That should have actually been easy on this floor. Oh no, we have these guys. Maybe it would What the heck? Maybe it wouldn't have been easy with these guys chasing me. No. Close. Bro, what are these shards? These are supposed to be random, right? I don't think they are. I heard the crystal key opening something. Oh? Down there? Oh. I like how there's just this random X rock in this in this red room, even though this isn't even depths two. I love how that can happen. And all this deaths listing. Hey, we got move speed. Sweet. This one's a bit dicey, mainly because these enemies are pretty difficult. But I guess if we play this smart, play our cards right, it shouldn't be that big a deal. All right, soul heart. Sweet. Pyromaniac, nothing to be sad about. Quite the contrary. Free death list that I almost ruined. Or some luck. Oh god. This actually does get a bit more difficult when you try to kill them in a certain order rather than as you see fit. But we got there. Oh no. No, I'm not doing this. Whatever. Sometimes I gotta think of my HP as well. Although I just gained a lot with that pyromaniac. Anything that involves enemies that die in one shot. Always a bit of a, a difficult one for death's list. Oop. No, don't make this guy stop. I need him to catch up to me. Okay. All right, we got more range. Got so much range at this point that I can maybe uh, hit delirium from across the room. Hey, I'm teleporting out of there. All right, horse pill. I can never say no to those. Get it. Youch. That hurt. 
And that is why I don't usually take pills, ladies and gentlemen. Nice lucky penny. I need something that actually works off of all of this luck that I have. I don't think I have anything. Also, I just realized I'm barely getting any golden chests. I have Guppy's tail. What is happening? Oops. My Guppy's tail is broken. What? You always forget this room exists until it happens, right? Well, there's my golden chest I get. And there's another one. The thing is, these have nothing to do with Guppy's tail, though, right? Like... Then that's just uh like that's just a room in the seating. Like <laughs> this has nothing to do with Guppy's tail. I very much appreciate it nonetheless though. Nice mom's ring for some damage. <laughs> that was a fast bomb. What's this? Joker card. Bro Pyro. Yeah, I'm definitely blowing up this uh blood donation machine that we had earlier. Because I have infinite bombs for this floor and Pyromaniac. Ah! Let me get out of here. Oh, Jesus. What a floor. What, wait, was there an unopened chest? It's okay, I'm gonna get it on the way back. There we go. Hey! I didn't even know it could open that! Yo, that's sick! Fruitcake! Do I want that? Yeah, sure. Fruitcake is goaded. I did not know that Cracked Orb could open crawl spaces. This is going to take a while if I want to uh, try to force a blood bag this way. Yeah, health up is too useful. At the same time, we all know I'm going to get... Never mind. An IV bag. Did I actually miss a chest there? I did not see it. Oh, I did. Oh, nice. And it's three cents, which I very desperately need. Ow. Oh, are you kidding me? There we go. Free key. What the heck, man? I'm a bit surprised. Oh, no, wait. I've seen this door already, right? Have I seen the super secret room already? I'm so headless on Curse of the Lost, man. But I also don't want to whip out MS Paint for every single... For every single Curse of the Lost floor. Because that gets real old real fast. Okay, there's my meat cube. There's my devil deal. There's my mark. I could take that for bookworm, but I'm not sure bookworm is worth a heart. Especially with... Um, uh, what's it called? Pyromaniac? Do I? I, I don't want to clear more of this floor. What's this? The floor is a mess. Had I not seen the item room and the store already, I definitely would have gone for more, but... Hey! Good one! Guppy's tail coming. Oh my god. Guppy's tail coming through. I'm not death listing here. Especially now that I'm getting random godhead tears and some stuff. There's just. Like, I like fruitcake, but it definitely significantly lowered the odds of me uh, getting death list to work. Not impossible, but definitely less likely. You know, with Guppy's tail starting to actually work over time, I'm not sure I want to go in there. I think I'd rather save my two keys. Okay. No, I messed up Death's list at the last second. That's a spiky chest. 
That is a store. Can I do this? That'd be kind of hype. Oh! Wait, what? Two items? Pyro? And the Bible? <laughs> I could use the Bible to um, fly over there, but since I'm about to pick up Pyro, that literally doesn't matter. <laughs> What's this? Ooh. So this one's actually worth it, right? Actually, no, this breaks even. I thought it gave me two charges. So it breaks even, which is also fine. Uh, Jar of Flies is actually kind of tempting because I picked up... I want to touch it at the very least for potential Lord of the Flies, right? I think I'm taking this with me. Like, I'm good on HP. I want to generate flies now. Okay, how do I death list here? I, okay, simple answer, I don't. What does that big battery do exactly? It instantly charges your use item at the cost of one heart, and then it has a chance to spawn somewhere else on the floor again. Another one. Hey! All right, all right. Chat, this is my moment. This is where we find the C-section. Also good. That's more fun, honestly. I, I just like that item. Bad trip. Mm. I very much like that item. Would grab the bracelet for butt knife, sure, but I don't care about the butt knife. Oh wow, somehow that worked. <laughs> there were probably ways to get Death's List to work there, most of which involved uh, actually utilizing that meat cube, but... Oh my god. This run took a while to go places, but now it's just going every place imaginable. I had to look for the run goal again because I took so much time here. I, I wasn't even sure where we're going anyway. Oh, see, there's the... There's the battery again. Soul of Magdalene. Okay, I want to go in here. We are in the guppy waiting room after all. And we will remain in the waiting room, it seems. Uh, we are now tier cap, yes. You guys think I can make the boss rush to use the Joker card to steal from it? Kidding. I don't think... No, a cracked orb cannot open the boss... It can? Well, I can't hurt myself, though, because during the mom fight, it won't open. And after the mom fight, I can't bomb myself because of Pyromaniac. Oh, boss challenge room. Yeah, I can't hurt myself there either. Oh, hold up. Damn. Hold up, watch this. Oh, I didn't open, Sag. Life is not fair, chat. I've been in the double key room. It had a bunch of batteries. Uh, okay, we take this with us. Because this, this is gonna murder mom, I imagine. If I kill mom fast enough here before she spawns any enemies, that's also a death's list execution. So that's nice. 
Uh, dark room, so we take this. That's also a free death list. That's a free lump of coal. And that is a trap door to the womb. Show us on this Isaac run where life hurts you. Life's been pretty good to me, honestly. No hurt here. Sorry to disappoint. Meh. Why is the door still closed? Because I didn't leave through the door. I left through the secret room again. Restock boxes always spawn in treasure rooms. Incredible trinket if you actually get it soon enough. Uh, getting that on the first floor where no item rooms spawn anymore. It's not optimal. Hey, I mean, Deathless gave us like three points of damage in this run, right? It's definitely done its job. There's not a whole lot of items that just give you plus three damage. So definitely nothing to resent there. Oh god, there's something to resent. Oh, this boss is an adventure. <laughs> Binky! Man, I'm just not gonna get guppy. So sad. Let's go for the super secret at least. I can go for the... I'll go for the, sac uh, the, the curse room. Come on. We can do it. For the fans. We will pursue the guppy waiting room. For the fans. Can the secret room be to my left for the fans? That'd be great. Hey, don't even need to pay a heart. I was actually considering picking up the quarter just to assert dominance, but... I decided against it for I don't know what reason. You ate beef tongue for the first time today. How did you like it? Tell us about the experience. Eh, I'm gonna give the uh, confession all a chance. Oh, fantastic. Play scam booth with bombs. I could probably get something out of that scam booth, but I'm not that that desperate to make the scam booth work. I'm sorry. Like this has already been a really long run. Let's wrap it up at this point. I'm gonna try and make guppy, and that's kind of gonna be it. So you can scam the scam booth. No, nobody scams the scam booth successfully. Let's be real. We we all know the damn thing would have found a way to reverse scam me. No crane game. I guess we blow up the dude. Whatever happened to bonus runs? I've been pretty tight for time during my streams in the last few days, but they will definitely make a return. We didn't stop enough. Nah, that one's not it.
Copy's tail has been a bit disappointing these last few floors again, has it? I haven't really seen that many golden chests. And that one I couldn't reach. Aside from the fact that it didn't have anything to do with Guppy's tail either. Because it was pre-spawned. Oh, there we go. Look at that. You just gotta complain. Just gotta complain to upper management. And suddenly the tail starts doing taily things. Dark Prince's Crown. I don't really see that going online. I'm not going in there. That's going to cost me two additional health to go in there. And I know the Ultra Secret can't be there. Oh my god. And just like that, Dark Prince's Crown is online. <laughs> and the Guppy Dream is still alive, chat. Two out of three. And Dark Prince's Crown also breaks the tier cap. So we're at 7.5 tier right now. It's okay, we're gonna get a devil deal. Like, literally, I have a joke card. <laughs> I, uh, I planned for that. I totally did not get betrayed by my muscle memory just now. And no Krampus. It can't be Krampus either, yeah, because we've already seen Krampus. Oops. I mean, I meant to do that. Uh, hold up. False PhD. That's gonna be damage. Addicted is gonna give me a free black card in here. Bad trip is just gonna be ne negative. Uh, net, net neutral, I mean. Range up is gonna give me damage. And x lax is going to spawn me a black card too. No, never mind. It doesn't. Did it? No. Okay. All right. No devil deal, but we can change that. No guppy peas, but a range down pill for some more damage. And a gimpy to put the Dark Princess Crown online again. And this is a dark room run, so we go this way. Ding dong, the Krampus is dead. Oh, what the heck? Okay, a bit of a disappointing floor so far, but at least we know where the secret room is. Man, did you have to spawn enemies? This could have been a death list. Quadruple champion husk. Yep. This is fun. Oh, no, it's, it's fine. It's not a big deal, but... A little bit irritating. What's that? Nothing. Still dodging explosions. Look, you can't turn off muscle memory. Addicted is just another black card again, so that's fine. Yo, I actually got Death's List! Judgment! <laughs> oh, wrong enemy. We can play this for a little bit. I don't want to dump too much time into this, but if I can get like a, the soul heart or two out of this, I'm actually going to feel a lot better immediately. I know exactly how long I'll play for. Oh, 
I was going to play until 69, but sure, if you want to break, that's okay too. I'm not going to pop that. I want to use it on the dark room, and I should be pretty close to getting there. Oh my god, that guy just ate all my flies. What a jerk. Now I'm going to eat his babies with C-section. Close. Okay, that's a free use. And I'm going the wrong way. I mean, I'm not death listing with a bunch of flies and fistula, so... Unfort. Got some move speed. From the list. Ooh. Wine dark room. What? Wine dark room because it reveals the map. And I want to see the map in the dark room immediately. I'm heading home. See you in a bit. Have a safe travel. Let's go. Zip. Fortune machines paying out, kinda. Oh, I don't even need the map in this because I just realized it's a Mega Satan run. <laughs> guppy, guppy! Heck yeah. And then we can even use the strength card to put Dark Prince's crown online again, which is better than using it to get the Horror of Babylon. Dude, dude. <laughs> the the in uh, what's it called the infestation no the uh hive mind the hive mind i picked up on floor one finally paying dividends look at how many stats i got from that from that strength card holy it's gonna be a breeze this is truly gonna be a cakewalk now that we're a cat before that, it would have just been a walk. Hagalas, we're gonna kill Mega Satan with that. Why no deaths list? Sorry, I forgot about it. Thanks, broken modem. What? I didn't even see what hit me. And hack a last kill. Nice. I reacted really late to that. That was very unauthentic. GG.